Hello everybody. I wanted to talk really quickly about um, my past with being on the LuLaRoe queue and how I decided to become an Agnes and Dora rep. So um, a few months back I was introduced to the um, the leggings from LuLaRoe um, because I'm a unique representative. Somebody tagged me on a cute pair of like makeup leggings. Um, they were super cute, but not really the kind of thing you like run, wear out and about. They, uh, here actually, they have nail polish bottles and stuff. I actually have two pairs of them. That one hasn't even been opened yet. And I like them a lot. I'm trying to make this video short. Okay. So I like them a lot when they came, they were super soft and buttery and all that good stuff. Um, <clears throat> but I didn't really wear them out of my house. I mean, I did. I threw them on like to go to the grocery store a couple of times, but they just didn't feel right to like wear them out and about because they're a little crazy, right? But they were super soft. So then, um, being of the direct sales mind and being a unique presenter, I was looking around at this business because I really had never heard of it before. So lots of cute clothes and after a long consideration, decided to get on the Q Club. Um, with a lot of doubts. I had a lot of doubts about the $5,000 buy-in and the mystery boxes and um, things like that. But I was really excited too at the opportunity and so I just went for it. Um, I had my unique business money to reinvest and so it was a decision that I had made. Um, as soon as I put my paperwork in, I had a lot of anxiety. I was worried about some of the things that were going to come along with this business. Um, and ultimately, decided that I didn't want to wait. <laughs> I didn't want to wait weeks and weeks and weeks while well, over a hundred people now it's being told that there's like 150 people a day being onboarded and it's just like wow. Um, as much as I love the clothes I'm the kind of person with a direct sales mind I'm looking for an opportunity as well something to grow and to get residual income eventually. So um, yeah so I basically had backed out of LuLaRoe and in the last few days of considering LuLaRoe I had found out about this business, Agnes and Dora, and on the chat groups, they were getting, it was getting a lot of good reviews. People were saying they liked it just as much as LuLaRoe, comfort-wise, and that a lot of the styles were a little more wearable and a little bit more, um, let's say mature, but not like old lady mature. Let's just say like the 30s, 20s, 30s whatever it doesn't matter style is style and it's all personal but so those are the things I was hearing so I looked into it and um, it was said that they're not MLM and so then I wasn't interested anymore but in the meanwhile I had put in some uh, I had put in an email to Agnes and Dora and I got a call from a lovely girl and she told me all about the business and how they were working currently on a compensation plan for Agnes and Dora and that really piqued my interest Luckily, of the very f small number of reps, right now there are four reps in New Jersey, um, one happened to be like two towns away from me, so I was able to go and see all the beauties, get some leggings for myself, and try on a bunch of products or, or clothing pieces, and loved everything. So, um, yeah, there's there are a lot of perks to this, um, to this business uh, with Agnes and Dora, and I'm so excited to be receiving my inventory soon. Um, super comfy, really cute, really wearable. You can look at agnesandora.com, but just be aware that the styles and the prints that you're gonna see on the website are limited because the products, the, the pieces are first released to the consultants to build their e-boutiques and their home boutiques, and then leftovers are on the website. So you're gonna see some cute stuff on the website, but you might feel like there isn't a lot, and that doesn't mean that you're not gonna get a lot, and that doesn't mean that Agnes and Dora doesn't have a lot to offer, because we really do. Um, lots of fun stuff. And look at this, this is one of our pencil skirts. So cute. And I put it on as a scarf like a little infinity scarf. So this is one of the Agnes and Dora pencil skirts. You can wear the pencil up high or you can fold and wear it, you know, shorten, shorten it to your desire. Um, <clears throat> so find me, actually I had to change my Facebook group name for continuity. So I am Agnes and Dora by Kelly G. You'll find me. I'll put the little, the whole thing here up on the bottom so that you can find me. But, um, and my email address is Agnes and Dora Kelly G at Yahoo. Yahoo! Um, <laughs> can you tell I'm excited about this? Um, so I just wanted to give you a little bit of pros and cons so you can make an educated decision yourself. I would be more than happy to be a referring rep and to help you get all uh, set up with Agnes and Dora if that's what you decided to do. But I just wanted to let you know that um, there are other options out there and um, you should possibly explore them and 
consider. You know, I mean, obviously the decision is yours in the end, but I'm happy to help if you decide that you want some more information on Agnes and Torah.